Hi again, everybody in YouTube land. My name is Daryl and my channel is Daryl Goes Shopping. And I go shopping at the Goodwill bins, um, which are the Goodwill outlet stores. And they're all over the United States. So if you're interested in doing something like this, uh, you know, Google uh, Goodwill outlet in your area and see what you can find. It's where the textiles are sold for $1.89 a pound. Um, and that varies depending on where you live. Um, I live in the Seattle area, and so that's where I do my shopping. And um, I have um, a bunch of stuff that I want to show you this time. And a lot of it's kind of eclectic. And so I'm, I'm going to have to do this uh, a little differently than I do sometimes. I like to give you comparable values for things, but if I can't find a comp, um, or if something doesn't have a label, um, it makes my job a little difficult. So I'm just going to put them on and have a good time. And I'm going to show you the stuff I got. And uh, so let's go for it. All right. Uh, this shirt right here does not have a label. And um, I got it because I am still very enamored of this waffle knit cotton gauze stuff. Um, and this color I just think is perfect for fall. Um, I'm pairing it up with uh, these uh, Levi's shorts and these cutoffs, which I might, I think I might cut them off a little bit more because I think this hole right here is awkward. It's because you can't roll them up all that much. Let's see, I guess they're okay. They're better like that. <laughs> <laughs> so okay I'm not ready for summer to be done can you tell and then uh, these are super cute shoes these are fit flops <laughs> I'll show them to you up close <laughs> so where shall we go next I have a ton of shirts, so let's just keep the Levi's on and go that away. <laughs> so I've been um, doing these videos with uh, um, oh this these pieces that are kind of like skims underneath, so I just don't have to worry about um, you know putting too much out there. So just kind of ignore the the, <laughs> the bits there; they're deliberate. Uh, this is a top from Top Shop, and a uh, cute sort of ditzy pattern, right? So I think we're, again, going to do a quickie round of tops, and I'm just going to kind of whip through them really fast. This is um, a quarter zip from North Face. This is from Halogen. This is from Airy American Eagle. I actually like this piece a lot. This sweet top is from Veronica M. And uh, I, you know, I got comps for it um, in a in a surplus cut, but I couldn't find them with this banded hem. Um, I'll show you the back. Super cute, and this the comps for this um, run a bit higher than you would think for a cute little black top. This is so cute. This is from a brand called Chelsea and Violet. Let's see. see, I do truly think it should continue to be summer, <laughs> but I'm gonna move into fall and winter. I love this ribbed fitness top. Um, it's going to look really cute for my next workout with my high-rise um, Lululemons. This is super cute. This is from a brand I am new to. It's called Pop Flex. And uh, it has a rather healthy price tag. Um, I love this cutout here. And uh, got it paired up with a pair of Flexies um, fitness pants. Not too sure about this band here because it's just too close to my skin color. So 
I love this to say um, fabrication. I saw this outfit on a girl when we were on vacation this summer, and um, I just thought it looked so awesome. And so when I saw it, I'm like, oh, I need to have that. Well, of course, at the bins. Um, I am not really sure what the brand is. I think I saw it online. I honestly don't remember where I saw it. Um, but here, look. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Now, I would like it with a, a tank top under it. Right now, I've got a cami on um, and maybe unbuttoned. Um, but you could do a lot of things with it. It's just super cute. The pants don't have pockets and they're a nice high rise fit. And it's green. The color of a bean. <laughs> so more green. I love this. This is from uh, Ann Taylor. Can't remember if it's Loft or Ann Taylor. I think it's Ann Taylor. But I love uh, green, like I mentioned. But I like the um, I like satin right now. I'm kind of liking it for fall. So I would pair this up with maybe high rise black pants, or maybe this skirt that I got coming up. This is an awesome Lululemon reversible Sherpa coat. Now it's a size four, and so I just automatically assumed it wasn't gonna work at all. But I have to say that I think it's doable. I would wear it, and it is so toasty warm when you've got this Sherpa on the inside. But let me show you with it on the outside too, because it's just so, so sweet. Isn't this cute? Oh gosh, I just love it. Hood. Oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Didn't see that coming. <laughs> I guess that's why it has drawstrings. <laughs> now I look like little Bo Peep. <laughs> okay, hoodie fail. I got so many tops. Um, on this trip and sweaters and jackets and uh, no, you know, I think three pieces for the bottom. And so I'm kind of at a loss what to do with everything. So um, just hang tight with me and I'll just show you everything in the way that it, it goes, right? <laughs> this is from J. Crew, and it's a stretch cotton um, shirt, perfect for everything. My size. I like this shirt now a lot better since I ironed it. Um, this is from Everlane and it is a silk, um, washable silk. Kind of a big black blob right now but as you can see it's a uh, it's, it's loose has a lot of uh, a lot of movement there I could easily tuck it in or wear it out uh, unbutton it and wear it um, with uh, something cute and lacy under it <laughs> this is a cute 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 dress this is from love stitch and I've kept my leggings on with it. Um, let me show you what it looks like as a dress. Cause, okay, let's see how it looks without the leggings. A little cuter. Trying not to have everything look like big black blobs, right? <laughs> anyway, this has got a, a tie in the back and a deep V as well. And uh, I just think it's really comfortable, really easy to wear. Um, let me try it with this. I'm gonna try this sweater with some other things because this sweater is the most amazing thing of everything that I got. It's from a brand called Kuyana and it is um, Angora, no, um, Alpaca. So it's like, elevated cashmere. 
made from those alp alpacas. <laughs> so this is one size, the sweater. And so I just love that it's, it's not too big, not too small. And I love the balloon sleeves. So just cute. Um, fall, winter cover up. I'm going to put it on with, um, a couple of other pieces so you can see how it, it, um, uh, works with a dress and, uh, with pants and skirts. All right. I want to show you this from afar because I just think it is so cute with this deep square neckline and it's a bodysuit. It's from Leith. And um, what I've had to do is keep my, uh, my undergarment piece on because um, I don't want to show you this without anything on under it. <laughs> but here we go. I just love this. I, <laughs> I want to go somewhere in it. It is just so bright. And so modern, I just, I really like everything about it. Well, <laughs> so check out this cute piece. This is from HD, um, which is an anthropology brand. And it's a, a nice long length and longer in the back with this cute kind of stand up collar in this double pleat. And it's kind of um, a dressy fabrication. I don't know what you'd call it. It's technically polyester and something, but kind of has a shimmer to it. This absolutely gorgeous blouse is real satin. It's silk satin. It's a vintage piece from Jones, New York. And uh, I'm gonna put it back to late 80s or early 90s. It's got shoulder pads <laughs> and I just think it's beautiful. And I want to see if this jacket works with it because this is another vintage piece. This is from Oscar de la Renta. And um, I'm going to show you this stuff close up first. It has these kind of panels and this quilting going on here in a bomber jacket sort of fit. I'm not really sure what the era is, um, but it's a great fit for me. It reminds me a lot of um, the Free People jackets that um, they've been putting out for a few years. Anyway, I love this blush color. Interestingly too, the zipper is green. You see that? <laughs> So let's, let's bring it down a bit. So I'm gonna have a little bit of my pink top hanging out. Isn't it just sweet? No one's gonna have a coat like this one. Here's the back. Cute, huh? I like the satin poking out too. I think it would work well to um, just open with jeans. This doesn't have shoulder pads actually. It's just got the quilting uh, going through it. So this may be 70s. That would be my guess. I honestly don't know what this is. It's uh, very tiny and very lightweight, and you see all of the, the, um, how what the fabric is, and then it has these things, <laughs> things, <laughs> and it's asymmetric, I think. All I have to say, I think I already own this sweatshirt, but maybe in a different size. <laughs> I believe this is from American Eagle Airy, and it's just their oversized sweatshirt that I love uh, for 
for all reasons, all seasons, all the time. And I love this kind of mint color. Check this out, okay? So this is another one of the pieces that I believe are vintage. It's got these three buttons here that um, bring this across. It snaps on the inside here and then crosses over. Can you see that here? So it's like this. Isn't it awesome? And it's a silk with all of this beautiful metallic work on it. And I really don't know what era this would be from. Um, <coughs> But I just, I, I love it. I'm crazy about it. <laughs> and I'm going to put it on with another pair of pants that I got. And I'll show you how that looks. So here are these pants that I paired this up with are, um, they're from Fashion Nova of all places. Um, so you know that they cost probably 20 bucks. But I love, they're a stretch fabric and a high rise and just this awesome, uh, puddle hem that I have paired up with these black suede boots from Forever 21. They're actually a nicer quality than I would have expected from that brand. Um, so just pretty cute um, bit of pieces randomly put together and they're just awesome looking, I think. So this is an awesome, another uh, unlabeled shirt. Um, the fabric is super nice. I wish you could feel it. It's very soft ribbed cotton and something else. <laughs> and uh, I've got it paired up with the Fashion Nova pants. Pretty cool. Let's see how that sweater goes with it all. Might be too much fabric really when you think about how how much fabric's in these pants but I guess that's all right kind of picks up the blue now where did I just throw my clicker I did literally throw it <laughs> huh. <laughs> there it is <laughs> A couple more really nice pieces to show you here. Um, I love this top. This is from Express. And it's the Portofino top. And what I like about it, it has these little studs on it. It just kind of gives it a little bit of sparkle and um, a little bit of extra. <laughs> I always like, I like extra. <laughs> so I want to show you some few more things. Um, this is an awesome buy, and boy, oh boy, do I wish they fit me, but they don't. They're Prada, and they are a cotton uh, spandex fabrication. They are uh, probably been taken in in the waist, looks to me like. Um, but I'm going to sell them on uh, eBay, and I will give the um, measurements. Look at that lovely, amazing wide flare leg. These are pretty current, gotta say. High rise. They'd fit me if I had a waist. <laughs> Shucks. <laughs> I have a couple of these already. These are Puma. Sports tops. These are Spanx. This is, uh, darn it anyway, a Lululemon size 2 skirt with the uh, shorts in it. I was going to try this on just to see if I could squish myself into it. How could I possibly be? <laughs> I guess they're so, <laughs> that there's not enough room for, they don't look like a skirt anymore when you, when you make them be four sizes bigger. But still, pretty darn cute. I think I have them on, right? Right. <laughs> 
I would wear them. Honestly, I would. So I would wear this as a dress. I think that's what it is. It's from Scotch and Soda. And it's their chevron print dress. And it has this um, cute little bobble that comes along, comes with it that I don't know where you want to put it up at the top or down at the bottom. I don't know. It's like, it's this kind of goes with it. And I think that I would pair this up maybe with some little socks and these. <laughs> Aren't they beautiful? They're the three eyelet Doc Martin Oxford. And I've wanted some of these for so long and I finally got some and they fit beautifully. I'm just super happy. And I have this super duper polish too that is um, just shines them right up, huh? Do, 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 do. <laughs> I didn't try them to see how they would look with this dress. Um, it would definitely make it a lot more casual. It would be cute with little boots too. <laughs> so, well, that's what it's all about, you know. It's messing around and experimenting. And I uh, just have... I think three more pieces now, and then that's going to be the end of it. So subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I only need maybe 699 more subscribers. So this is a, a set of things that, uh, it's a skirt and a blouse, and they're both from Theory. And uh, I know that the comps on this blouse ran something like $350. My problem with these tops from Theory is that they are never... They never fit me well enough in the chest. Um, and it isn't like, <laughs> it's a great huge expanse there. Um, but they just, I always need to like pin them. And so if I pinned this here, it would probably be okay and wearable. But really what is the standout piece with this outfit is this skirt and I'm gonna show it to you with a different shirt on, okay? Okay, this is the last of it, you guys. And uh, I feel like I need to go off someplace and have some cocktails. I think this is like vintage 60s. Not entirely sure, but this wider neckline with the sleeves like this um, just look a little bit like that era. And uh, it doesn't have any tags. Look at these cute little, um, well, I don't know if you can see them because of the skirt, but let me show you all this whole, whole thing. <laughs> I need, do, do, do. <laughs> Either that or, do, 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 do. That was the twist. <laughs> it's from Theory, and it is very, uh, the, the bottom part is very stretchy, so very easy to wear. And then this nice top satin piece, which just keeps everything nice and flat and organized. <laughs> I need to have my abs organized. <laughs> they need something. <laughs> so anyway, my friends, YouTubers, that's all for this time. And I have I have done a video for everything that I've gotten. And so now I can go to the bins again and go digging some more. So thanks for hanging with me. We'll see you on the flip side. Bye.